What's up everybody, Roderick here with the unboxing of the Samsung Galaxy Amp 2. Now this is a Cricut branded phone and if you want it, it's $50 if you get a new number or upgrade and it's free if you actually port your number over to Cricut. So we can't complain too much. So we're gonna take a look. So the outside we got Samsung Galaxy Amp 2. This side Samsung, this side some important information. Bottom right here, let's take a look at some specs. It's an Android phone with a bright 4.5 inch display, quad core processing power and 4G LTE speed, 5 megapixel rear camera with flash and HD video, and 2 megapixel front camera. So, sounds pretty good. Pretty good, not great, but you know, it's alright. So, this is just what they would fill out, I guess, if you activated it in the store. Alright, so, let's unbox this thing and see exactly what comes in it. So right here we start off with the phone. Yeah, you know, not bad, I guess. Put that to the side. Inside, right here, we got a clear and simple quick start guide. We don't need that. We also got another manual, terms and conditions. We don't need any of that. It's a waste of paper, waste of trees. Got the battery here. So that's a plus right there. It actually has a removable battery. So let's put this thing in. Pull off the back, got the SIM card already inside. Put that right here and also micro SD card slot. So a lot of high-end flagship phones don't have micro SD card slots or removable batteries, and this does, so, you know, it's gotta be worth something, right? And it's a 2,050 milliamp hour battery. All right, on the side right here, we got the power button, so we're gonna power this thing on. Just hold it down. There we go. On this side, we got the volume rocker. On the bottom, micro USB charging port. On the top, headphone jack, which a lot of flagships don't have as well. So I'll put that phone to the side. Inside, we got a nice length micro USB charging cable. Oh, look at the animation, the music. And the charging brick. Yep, pretty basic, pretty basic. Throw that off to the side. Now we got the phone, welcome. All right, so we'll do English. Just like a lot of all right, so setup is pretty standard. All right, made it to the home screen. Here we go. So, as you see, right now it's actually pretty snappy. It does have a quad core processor if that means anything to you. All right, it comes preloaded with Cricut apps, including My Cricut, Visual Voicemail, Deezer Music, and Full Screen, which I'm not sure what that is. Let's see, so pretty basic Android at the app drawer. Pretty much the same as any other Galaxy phone just on a smaller form factor and cheaper build quality. It's pretty much made out of plastic here. All right, so let's take a look at this camera. Let's see, got a Xbox controller right here. Now we're gonna let's see, location tags. Let's see if this camera's any good. Okay, pretty slow, but I think it's because the flash was on, so no flash. Okay, still pretty slow to focus, so by the time you take the picture, it will be too late. All right, so zooming in on the picture, it isn't the worst picture I've ever seen, but I mean, it's not flagship material. So this phone is actually pretty good at getting blurry pictures of Bigfoot. So if you're looking for Bigfoot, this is the phone you need. Yeah, so not too bad. See the one with the flash? Yeah, as you can see, it is kind of really grainy and blurry. But, I mean, free phone, can't really complain. This phone's probably good for kids' first phone, or maybe a trap phone, you know, to each his own. And that's pretty much it. It's a decent phone for free, can't complain. So, make sure you guys comment down below, let me know what you guys think. Make sure you hit the red subscribe button for more. Make sure you guys give this video a nice thumbs up. And until next time, Sir Roderick, I'm out. I'll catch you in the next one. Y'all should know my name. I'm a big shot. The plan is to 